Emma, I cannot believe you did that to Uncle Stefan. You lied to him. Why did you do that? <gasps> Mommy, I already said I was sorry. But I wanted to have a birthday just like Isabel. Oh. oh, Emma, where do you get those ideas from? Oh, I have no clue. Oh. Anyway, that's not right. Mommy, I don't know where I got that idea. I just really want a birthday party. Hmm. But why are you looking at me like that, huh? I had nothing to do with it, not this time. Hmm, Julian, I think your crazy ideas are rubbing on your sister. Hmm. But maybe she's thinking like you. Yes, Mommy, I think it was Julian, yeah. Julian told me about this telepathically. Wait, 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 what? Mom, that's not true. I didn't tell her anything. It was her own doing. Uh, yeah, Julian is right. You cannot blame others for your actions, Emma. You're grounded. Wait, what? Grounded? What does that even mean? I have no idea. That means you're gonna stay at home and you're gonna just be quiet, okay? <laughs> Did I hear that right? You are grounded. <laughs> what? I don't even know what that means, but anyway... Oh, I just wanted a birthday party. Well, grounded means that you get to be in your own room, okay? It's like house arrest, but like room arrest. Yep, so so, so you get to be there, okay? Now look, this is the border. You cannot cross it, okay? You're there. Wait, but mm -hmm. what if I want to go pee? Or what if I'm hungry? What am I going to do then? Well, then, then you ask me nicely and I can go get things for you. This sucks. I don't want to be... Here, Julian, can you give me the phone, please? Yeah, 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 okay, I'll give you the phone. And some hot cocoa if you can. Oh, okay. Okay, Emma's on house arrest. <laughs> Why can I not leave this room? Is this room arrest? I don't like it. <laughs> um, Julian, what are you doing with the phone? What? Oh, Mom, um, Emma wanted it. I don't know for what, but I'm probably calling a friend. <gasps> no, don't give it to her. What if she calls the cops and tells them that I have grounded her? Oh, pff, Mom, no, she, Emma's not gonna do that. She's probably gonna go call her friends or something. It's fine, it's fine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Do I really think my daughter would call the cops on me for grounding her? Hmm. Maybe. You never know with Emma. Hmm. Oh, wow. Julian, can I have some ice cream, please? Oh, for sure. Yeah, come get it. Oh, wait, never mind, I forgot, you cannot leave your room. <laughs> oh, maybe next time. Julian, you're the meanest older brother in the world. Oh, you're just there. <laughs> oh, this ice cream is so good. Yeah, so good. Okay, whatever. Hello? Uncle Stefan? Hi, I just wanted to apologize. Uncle Stefan, are you really calling him? I am very sorry for pretending it was my birthday, but I, I would like to apologize in prison, but I'm grounded. Wait, let me ask mommy if we can go visit. Mommy! Mommy, can we go visit Uncle Stefan? I want to apologize in person. Huh, Emma? But you cannot leave, you're grounded. But well, I guess if you want to be, if you want to go apologize in prison, let's go. Yay, do you hear that Uncle Stefan? We're on our way. Wait, wait, what? That's not fair. Whenever I'm grounded, I'm grounded the whole day and Emma just got 10 minutes? That's not fair, Mom. What? Julian, stop. We're just gonna go say hi to Uncle Stefan and then she's grounded again. Haha, <laughs> excuse me. I can go get my own ice cream. <laughs> what? Seriously, not fair. Julian, stop. <sighs> well, clearly someone else in this house is the, the preferred child. Hmm, <laughs> The favorite. Oh, Claudia, would you like some coffee? Thank you, yeah. Where, where's your wife? Oh, she's gone, but the twins are with me. Oh, I'm so bored. Maybe I should look at what Uncle Stefan has in his fridge. Emma, you cannot go opening other people's fridges. It's called privacy. Please, come on. Okay, here are the twins. Oh, Kyle and Kevin. Oh, they're so cute. Look at them. They're so grown. Yeah, yeah, their hair is growing too. We shave them. We want to shave them, but they don't even have hair. They have less hair than me. Why would you shave them? Weird. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's why. Their hair looks so nice and shiny now. 
Ah, oh, yeah, I've heard that, but my kids weren't shaved. What? So that's a secret? You just cut your hair and then it grows better and shinier? Oh, I wish I would have done that. Emma, Emma, no, your hair is very pretty. Oh, and look at this blonde hair. Just like mine. Yes, Mommy, they look like they could be your twins. <laughs> that's so funny that you say that. Julian actually <sighs> mentioned it when he met them. Oh, they're super sweet. Look at them. <laughs> hey, Kyle. Hey, Kevin. Yeah, they're really cute. Oh, anyway. Uncle Stefan, does your wife have blonde hair? Oh, Emma, I think you came here for a reason, right? So go ahead. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what is it that you want to tell me, Emma? Oh, Uncle Stefan, I wanted to apologize for pretending that it was my birthday and making you build all of those cool things. Oh, you're fine, Emma. Kids are always... Uh, telling me things and I fall for them every time. Oh, I'm sorry, Stefan, I'm very embarrassed because I know Julian has been playing, like, tricks on you and making you do things for him. Oh, seriously, no problem. I'm the fun uncle that gets to build crazy things for their, for, for his niece, nieces and nephew. It's all good. Drink more coffee. Actually, I need to go to the coffee shop. Something came up. Mommy, I can come with and I can learn from you. Oh, Emma, you better stay. I'll come get you in a bit. Thank you, Stefan. I'll be right back. Oh, Emma, maybe you want to go check the twins' room. You're going to like it. Yes! Oh, and I want to go see it. Okay, so here's the room. Isn't it nice? Wow! Well, you have your own ball bed? Uncle Stefan, did you build this? Whoa, wow. that's so cool. I want to go jump in. Oh, yeah, I built things for you. For Julian and also for my kids. Wow, how fun! I want one for my bedroom. Oh, that would that would be really nice. Oh, okay, I think I need to change. Kevin, come on. Oh, Kevin, don't cry, don't cry. Hmm. Oh wow, I think Kyle also needs a diaper change. Hmm. Oh really? Oh, Emma, I forgot the baby bottles are in the kitchen. Could you please grab them for me? Of course, I'll be right back. Babysitter Emma on her way. Oh, actually, the extra help is really nice. What if Emma becomes a babysitter when she's older? Hmm. Okay, here are the baby bottles for Kevin and for Kyle. And, oh, are these the scissors I used to cut the twins' hair? I probably should cut mine and then it's going to grow shinier and brighter and prettier. Oh, don't cry, my little one. Don't cry. The bottle is on its way. Emma, la la la, and then more here, and then more there. Oh, I better go check on her. I don't know what's happening. Emma, what are you doing with the scissors? No, stop. No, 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 I'm cutting my hair so that it grows prettier, Uncle Stefan. Just like the twins. Yep, I want to have hair like them. No, no, Emma, Emma, no, we don't play with the scissors, okay? And you're not going to cut your hair. Oh, what? Oh, that's not fair. I wanted bright hair just like the twins. Ah, uh, anyway, I'm leaving. Wait, Emma, we need to bring the baby bottles. No, I'm going home. I have a pair of scissors at home that I'm going to use. Yes. Goodbye, Uncle Stefan. Emma, no, you're not going by yourself. Oh, imagine how mad Claudia and Martin are going to be if Emma cuts her hair off. Oh. <laughs>